Hi, I'm Deb Malone, the Executive Director of the Hudson Valley Gateway Chamber of Commerce, filling in for Mayor Frank Catalina at a wonderful grand opening that we have here at the Hat Factory, 1000 North Division Street, RG Agency, Robin Goldsands Company. Robin, is great to have you be moving and staying at Peekskill. Um, you have to take a look at her file. How many files do you have back there, Robin? About 50,000 files, over, fi over 50 years, 60 years of it being in business. This is our 60th anniversary. And, and one of the attorneys that are here today said that um, the reason they do business with uh, RG Agency is because they have such great files and they can get something for so long ago, which I guess a lot of agencies maybe can't provide. Also here today is our councilman, Joe Torres. Hi, how are you? Hi, how are you, Joe? Good, doing good. Isn't this great up here? <laughs> great, beautiful. Another you know, great, great business in Peekskill. And it's good to see all these businesses coming to Peekskill, so it's uh, great to have her here. Thank you. And we have our acting city manager, Richard Lines. Yes, so thank you so much. It's great to be here. And uh, Robin brings a long legacy of many, many generations, commitment, and love uh, for the city of Peekskill. So we welcome her and congratulate her on her relocation. It's a wonderful news for the city and for RG Agency. Thank you, Robin. Thank you, Richard. And I'm signaling here because the uh, Hudson Valley Gateway Chamber of Commerce chairperson of the board, Jane Solnick, is standing behind Mike Miner, and I'm saying, come over here, come over here. <laughs> so uh, you have some staff here today. Why don't you tell us, you want to tell us a little bit about the history of the hat factory? I mean, this yes. opened in 1915. I know we profiled it in our 100th anniversary edition last year. Uh, but this, I guess this was a New York City company that came up here after the company here left? Yes, actually it started out as a boys' orphanage, then it became, uh, the, and I, we have people here from the museum that can even help out here. A lot of the pictures around here are from the Mu Peatskill Museum, and they've lent the history and the pictures. And so, and then it, it was a boys' orphanage at first. Then it was um, actually they had a Jello jelly factory here, which was a front for bootlegging. And uh, then they had the hat factory because the one in Yonkers burnt down and they moved up here. And they have various businesses here now, artists and all kinds of tech businesses. And I want to show appreciation for history, appreciation to all my staff here. We have Andrea, Amy, Bob, and Charlie, and to all my clients and friends that came because without you, we really couldn't grow and we have been growing we really appreciate the city and the chamber coming up so we moved from downstairs up here and we have all the files to prove it and we really want to thank you deb for doing this it's it's, it's our pleasure it's always great to have a company uh, that your company started in 1956 you're celebrating 60 years and it opened up on North Division Street, correct? You had your, it was an attorney's and office. Title. Yes, and the title, it was, right. now I think there is a liquor store there now where there is, was the title agency. Uh, bodega. Uh, bodega, yeah. okay, that's what's there now. But her family has stayed in this community all of these years. Robin is a very, very, very big supporter of the chamber. Also, she's a great volunteer. She's on the board of the Peekskill Museum. She gives a lot of her time to our community. And um, the fact that she has decorated her office in pictures from uh, Think Town and the old hat factory just goes to show how much she loves Peekskill. So do you want to introduce some of you? Your employees? Yes. I want to introduce Andrea Shaw, Amy Gervalo. Wave, say hi. Uh, Charlie Sockinger, Bob Hermesh. Uh, there's two more that are missing, but um, I really appreciate everything that they do here, and we all love to work together. This is a great new space we've gotten, and we're really looking forward to good things here. Okay, well, we're happy you're staying here. So. Are we ready to cut the ribbon? We're ready. Okay. <laughs> All right. So, on three, okay. one, two. two, three. There we Yay! Are. We are officially open for business or continuing business. Okay, Robin. Thank you so much. Okay. All the best to you. Okay. Thank you to the city manager. Thank you to Joe Torres for being here and to Jane for being here and Joni Surfman on Board of Directors here someplace, okay? 
Thank you, everybody. Please come to the Hat Factory. It's a great place to visit. Uh, ben Green has done a wonderful job, and it's, it's kind of a very bohemian feel because there is so many uh, media and production companies and, and agencies here. But um, it really, he's done a great job with this, this beautiful old building. So with that, thank you very much, and have a great day. Hi, over my shoulder is a picture of my Uncle Joe. He loved to ride his bike. He was my partner for 15 years when we bought from my father, Ronald Goldson, who started the title business in 1956. So my uncle just passed away last year from pancreatic cancer, and we miss him, and we learned a lot from him, and so we're still hanging in there. And this is from where my father started was at the monument, actually in his father's office, which was real estate. My father started the title insurance business, 1956. We bought him out in 1999, and now we're here at the Hat Factory for 15, 16 years.